It's time for person, place, or thing. Our first player is Yotam, and his favorite person is Albert Einstein. Our second player is Brandon, and his favorite place is Paris, France. And our third player is Cordy, and his favorite thing are his nunchucks. And now, because she finally shaved her legs, our host, Melissa Peterman! I did, and it took days. <laughs> Welcome to Person, Place, or Thing, the game where great questions and a sharp mind can send you home with cash and prizes. And joining me today is a very sharp threesome who are here today to battle it out for a shot to win our grand prize, $5,000. And back for his fifth consecutive day is our returning champion, Brandon, who so far has won $10,000 in cash and prizes. And I know he's hoping to make it back into that final round and win another $5,000. But you know what, Brandon, I think that Yotam and Cordy may be looking to start a winning streak of their own. Right, guys? Yeah, of course. First consecutive day. First consecutive day. That's a good way to look at it. Okay, well, let's get started then. We're gonna start off with round one. We are gonna play each category, a person, a place, and a thing. You could ask me yes or no questions, and I will be giving you some clues along the way. You ready? Let's go. Okay, hey, Brandon, Hello. welcome back. Thank you, good to be back. Uh, was your mom excited when you told her that you won and oh. that trip to Paris is on? My gosh, she still has not come down to the, the floor. <laughs> okay, good, well, that's very exciting. We're gonna start off today with our person category, and I can tell all of you that your person is a celebrity. Okay. Celebrity. Is this celebrity female? Yes. All right. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yo, Tom, hi. Hi. Welcome to Person, Place, or Thing. I'm so happy to be here. I'm so very happy that you are here. Do you have a question for me? Uh, yeah. Is she in movies? No. Hmm. No, not really known for movies. Okay. No. Okay. Hi, uh, Cordy. Did I hear that your favorite thing, is it your nunchucks? Nunchucks. Did you bring them today? I did not. Okay, shoot. I, I really know. like to learn that. <laughs> yeah. All right, uh, we know that we have a celebrity who's female, not really known for movies. Okay. Ask away, ask away. Is this female celebrity a singer? No. Okay. Not a singer either. Okay, get your buzzers out. It's time for a clue. Remember, if you get this right, you got 100 points, but if you are wrong, you are out until I give another clue. This person worked as Paris Hilton's nanny in the 1990s. Brandon. Is it Kim Kardashian? No, it is not Kim Kardashian. Yo, Tom, it is not Kim Kardashian. I think I'm, I'm interested in knowing if she's still alive. Well, she is. Yes. Okay. Good still for alive. Her. Yeah, good for her. <laughs> I mean, that's all you can really ask for right. every day is that you you're here. You're yeah, here. Yeah. Cordy. Is this person um, American? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Time for another clue. Get your buzzers out. She was an original cast member on The Real Housewives of New York. Oh my goodness, clearly none of you have been over to my house. <laughs> Brandon. Okay, um, is this person over the age of 40? Yes. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yo, Tom, you don't watch either? Not really reality TV kind of person. Okay. Don't expect uh, that I'll know this one, so I'm just gonna ask, was it okay. you? Was it me? <laughs> was it you? Oh my gosh, thank you. No, it wasn't, it wasn't. But if I was, this would be my tagline here. People say I'm crazy. Well, they're right. <laughs> Yeah, you'd like I would have watched. You would have watched that? Okay, watched. thanks, thanks. Um, no, it's not me, it's not me. Um, I don't have that. <laughs> Cordy, you don't watch either? No. People? No, nothing out. It's so good. Is this female celebrity still on The Royal Housewives of New York? Oh, no. Okay, here is your third and final clue. She founded a successful low-calorie cocktail brand. What? <laughs> You've no, never no. seen Skinny Girl Margarita? Uh, no, Skinny Girl Margarita, but I'm no, okay. I use, no? I forget. Oh my God, Bethany Frankel! Oh, Bethany oh, Frankel, she's been in the okay. news tonight. Yes, I know don't nothing. Know who that is. Yeah, I okay. Nobody got those points, and um, I feel bad for you because you're missing some great television. <laughs> Yo, Tom, all right, you're gonna start off our next category, and I can tell you that this category um, is a place, and this place is a tourist attraction. Ooh, is yes. it in the United States? Yes. Oh. It is. Okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Is this place 
in Florida? No. Okay. Not. Good question. Question indeed. Brandon? Is this tourist attraction in New York? No, but the Real Housewives of New York <laughs> is in New York, and you should be watching it. <laughs> I'm so ashamed. <sighs> okay, it is time for a clue about this tourist attraction. This place has the world's first solar-powered Ferris wheel. Brandon? Is it Santa Monica Pier? It is the Santa Monica Pier. Well done. 100 points to you. And that means we're on to our last category in this round. And Cordy, I'm going to start off with you. And I'm going to tell you, this is our thing category. Okay. This thing is a drink. Is this drink alcoholic? No. OK. Mm -hmm. No, it is not. Brandon. Is this drink carbonated? No, it is not. No, Tom. Is this a specific brand of drink? No, not a specific brand of drink. Okay. Okay, time for a clue. Get mm -hmm. those buzzers out. More than 90% of its US supply is produced in Florida. Yo, Tom. Is it orange juice? It is! It is OJ! 100 points to you. We got ourselves a game. Do not go anywhere. Brandon and Yo Tom are tied with 100 points. Cordy is not on the board yet, but that could change because we got a lot of game to play. Up next, we got great questions and even greater clues on person, place, or thing. more about our show and meet today's super fan use your smartphone to scan the qr code in the corner of your screen and you will not only meet today's super fan rona but you're gonna get access to behind the scenes fun and bonus content Welcome back to Person, Place, or Thing. Here's Bethany Frankel's biggest fan, Melissa Peterman. <laughs> well, I'm the only one here today anyway, so I'm representing. Welcome back. We have a great game. Brandon and Yotam are tied with 100 points. Cordy is not on the board yet, but don't worry, because we got lots of game to play, and round two is coming up. Round two is played the same as round one, except we're doubling the points, and you all get to pick the category that we are playing. Cordy, since you are behind, you are going to start off. What category would you like to play? Do you want to do a person, a place, or a thing? I'm going to go thing. Thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. I like things. I can tell you that this thing is technology. Does this thing come with a camera? Yes. Mm -hmm. Friend. Is this technology small enough to hold in your hand? Yes. Yo, Tom. Does this thing have a touch screen? Yes. Are you ready for a clue? Remember, these are worth 200 points if you get it right. This was introduced to the world at a San Francisco trade show in 2007. Brandon? The iPad? It is not an iPad. Cordy. Um, is this thing an iPhone? Ah, yes, it's an iPhone, not an iPad, which means 200 points. So you look at, you just went from last to the lead, right there. Well done, well done. Okay, Brandon, your turn to pick. Which category do you want to play? Uh, let's go with a person. You, that's your category, isn't it? It is. Is you feel lucky? Yeah, I'm a people person. You are a people person, <laughs> okay. Well, Brandon, I can tell all of you that this person's an actor, okay? Um, is this actor living? Yes. Okay. Yes. Hmm. Hmm. Is this actor male? Yes. Yes. Is Hi. this actor a TV actor? Yes. Okay. Yes. Ready for a clue? Yes. Buzzers out. This rapper has appeared on Law & Order SVU for 23 seasons. Brandon? I see. Boom! It is iced tea. Okay, you just got so, yourself back in the lead with 200 uh, points there. Do you watch that? Uh, yo, Lord, yes. I love it. I mean, it's been on so long and it's Heifer. still so good. Yes. Okay, yo, Tom, it's your turn to pick the category. What do you uh, want to play? Well. Well, for my category, yes, I am afraid of 
people, and I'm afraid oh, am of I most too close? things. <laughs> it's too close for you. I like, I like space, which is why I'm going to go with place. Okay, I promise I will stay <laughs> distanced from you. I understand. Oh, no, no, you're... I know, I realized I was invading your you're space, You're so too. lovely. Okay. And I love that dress. It's so pretty. Oh, thank you. But I'll respect your boundaries. <laughs> <laughs> I like places too. Me too. And I can tell you that this place is an outer space. <gasps> is this place a planet? Yes. Planet. Cordy. Is this place close to the sun? No. Okay. Brandon. Is it a gaseous planet? How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> I had falafel for lunch. And I'm sorry. Your many things, a planet I, is not one of them. Yes, <laughs> I'm sorry. Is it a gaseous planet? Yeah. Um, yes, it's very gaseous. But you know what? It's not its fault. So don't get all up in this planet's no, junk, Brandon. <sighs> all right, you guys ready for a clue? Bless yes. indeed. <laughs> This is the third largest planet in our solar system. Yo, Tom. Is it Neptune? Okay, <laughs> hello. 200 points, place was a great choice for you. I because studied guess physics. What? You studied <laughs> physics. Well done. Now that is how you do round two. Don't go anywhere. Brandon and Yo, Tom are tied with 300 points and Cordy right behind him with 200. But that could all change because up next, it's the speed round. And we're gonna see who's gonna walk away a winner on person, place, or thing. Everyone gets gaseous. If you're a person who wants to come to this place and do this thing, go to person, place, or thing on TV.com, and I'll see you here. Welcome back to Person, Place, or Thing, where we're drinking iced tea, lemonade, and skinny girl margaritas. Ah, yes. <laughs> We had a great game here. Brandon and Yotam are tied with 300 points, but Cordy is right behind him with 200. But that could all change in 90 seconds because it's time for our speed round. Get your buzzers ready. I'm gonna read AC. Oh, ooh, nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I love that. You are ready to play. Uh, I'm gonna give you show. a series of clues about a person, a place, or a thing. Think you know it, you buzz in, you got 500 points. You buzz in and you're wrong, you are locked out until the next category. You ready to do it? Let's do it. All right, Jamie, 90 seconds on the clock, please. Oh, Melissa, I'm trying to practice my nunchucks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, players, good luck. Yo, Tom, I know you study physics, but let's see how fast I can read. <laughs> Everybody, <laughs> time starts now. This thing is a cutting tool with a metal blade. It is often... Cordy. Knife? No. It is often used with a hammer or mallet. Chisel. Yo, Tom. Chisel. Yes. This was the second U.S. state to join the Union. Its nickname is the Keystone State. Cordy. Shh. Time's up. All right. Two major league baseball teams play here, the Pirates and the Phillies. Brandon. Pennsylvania. Yes. This person was a story editor for the Twilight Zone. He won a Hugo Award for science fiction. Brandon. Rod Serling? No. The TV show Game of Thrones was based on his books. J George R.R. R. Martin. S sorry? George R.R. R. Martin? Yes. This present day country is where the ancient city of Troy was located. Turkey. Yes. This person was an LA Lakers cheerleader. Her big hits include Straight Up and Brandon. Paula Abdul. Yes. This organization's goals include promoting peaceful societies worldwide. It's U.S. It's courting. Peace Corps. No, it's U.S. headquarters are the in. UN. Yes. This person's parents, Eleanor and Francis, are both successful filmmakers. Real time. Uh, Francis Ford Coppola. Uh, no, she was the first American, uh, Brandon. Sophia Coppola. Okay, this person started their career in commercials. He played the dad on Malcolm in the Middle. He won it, Brandon. Brian Cranston. Yes, this is the oldest institute for higher learning in the English speaking world. Oxford. Yes, the inventor of this machine was in the refrigeration business. Its parts, uh, Edison? No, its parts include a snow container, a board brush, and a water tank. This machine, oh! I needed to go back and get a degree because I couldn't read fast enough for you all. That was an incredible speed round. Wow. I mean, Brandon, you fought.
fought valiantly, <laughs> and it was neck and neck. And I mean, Cordy, you were throwing stuff in there, but you know what? Twenty-three hundred for you, Brandon. But yo, Tom, congratulations! You are moving on to play our final round. We got a new champ. <laughs> new champ in there. But Brandon, I you were here. We loved having you. What five consecutive days in a row? Indeed. You were phenomenal. You got ten thousand dollars in cash and prizes. You were taking your mom Shelly to Paris. You were wonderful. Cordy, we loved having you. You Thank were fabulous. You. And we're not gonna send either of you home empty-handed. So Jamie, tell them what they've won. Crumble Cookies. It's the fastest growing cookie franchise in the world. Home of the weekly rotating menu and its award-winning milk chocolate chip cookie. Crumble serves gourmet cookies. Is big enough to share with your friends and family. Treat yourself to some happiness with Crumble. Ah, I hope you enjoy the sweet treats. They're really good. Do I get that? Oh, no, but you get a chance to play <laughs> for fun. No cookies for you, but hopefully we're going to win you some dough, okay? Yeah. All right, congratulations, Yo, Tom. You are moving on to play for $5,000 in our Thank final God. round, Thank sponsored you. by Caesar Slots. Jamie, tell them about it. Promotional consideration provided by Caesar Slots, an amazing free slots game. Download now for an incredible welcome bonus. Stick around to see if Yo, Tom will win $5,000. We'll be back right after this. No cookies for you. No cookies. Now it's your turn to play. Scan the QR code to win this amazing prize. A three-month membership to Crunch, a gym that believes in making serious exercise fun by fusing fitness and entertainment and pioneering a philosophy of no judgments. Good luck. Welcome back to the final round of Person, Place, or Thing. I'm standing here with Yo Tom, who's about to play for $5,000 from our friends at Caesar Slots. Jamie, tell them about it. Promotional consideration provided by Caesar Slots, the legendary free slots game with hundreds of slots and exciting jackpots. It's Vegas in your hands. Scan the QR code to download Caesar Slots and spin the Caesar's way. Thank you, Jamie. Okay, here's what you gotta do. You have to correctly identify a person a place, and a thing in 60 seconds. You can start with any category that you want. You can ask me as many yes or no questions as you need to. And you know what? I got three clues for you. You can use them any way you want, all at once, spread them out, but use them. You correctly identify a person, a place, and a thing, and you're gonna walk home with $5,000, and our super fan gets $500. You ready to do this? Let's go. Okay, I can tell you that your person is an athlete. <laughs> Brave face. You don't seem excited about that. Uh, your place is a historical building. Better. Good, better. And your thing is a plant. Where would you like to start? A uh, historical building place, please. Okay. Jamie, put 60 seconds on the clock, please. Come on, Yo Tom. I think there will be dancing today. Yes. <laughs> okay. You got this. We're starting with our place category, which is historical building. Good luck. Time starts now. Is it in Europe? Yes. Greece? No. France? Yes. Notre Dame? No. Uh, is it in Paris? No. Is it Versailles? Yes. Uh, plant? Okay. Uh, is, is it a tree? Uh, no, would you like a clue? Yes. This flower has edible seeds that can be eaten as a snack. Is it a sunflower? Correct. Okay, uh, are they alive? Uh, no. Male? Yes. Get me the first clue. This person is the first American track and field athlete to win four gold medals at the Olympic Games. Uh, Jesse Owens? Boom! Oh! Yo, Tom, okay. First of all, Mr. Oh, I don't know athletes. I don't wanna do an athlete. I don't wanna do an athlete. You had 28 seconds left. Another clue left. You just congrats, you got $5,000, my friend. <laughs> and you get to come back again as our returning champion for a chance to win another $5,000. And congratulations to you, Rona in Norman, Oklahoma. You just won $500. Okay, there you are, hi! 500 bucks, super fan! We love it! Thanks for playing! Okay, yo, Tom, what? what? This person's coming back to this place tomorrow to do this thing. I don't want an athlete. You're still watching? 
Oh my God, thank you. Well, in that case, be sure to stay up to date with Person, Place, or Thing by smashing that subscribe button. There's full episodes, behind the scenes content, and even a few surprises, and they're just a click away. You can go now.